Right, so I've done it again. I'm receiving a beacon on C4FM on 29.250. This person, K5DNA, 4,493 miles away. I'm picking up their beacon on uh, 10 meters C4FM. All I've done, I've gone into the VFO. I'm on 29.250 DN mode. You press the group monitor button in the bottom left. And it shows all the stations that are keying up on this frequency. And I'm using no internet. I'm out mobile. I've just got a 10 meter it's a Scarlet Warrior aerial on the car. I've been trying many, many months to do this. And uh, I had to update the firmware on the Yaesu FT5D. The original firmware would not allow C4FM receive on uh, 10 meters. So I updated the firmware. I've had it working on the 991A. I think it works on the 991. Uh, put it in the comments. Now it might work on the FT3D, but because I had to update the firmware, I'm thinking possibly not. Uh, but you know, it might be something that they'll add or it might be available. So let me know in the comments. And what people do is they send out a beacon like this and people receive them. They just key up. It shows people keying up. It automatically beacons out. And you can check if people can hear you by going to a Facebook page. I'll put a photo of it at the end. It's called 10 meter C4 FM. Uh, something like that. So I'll put a photo up at the end and um, you can have a bit of fun with this. You know, if you've got a C4 FM radio that will transmit on 10 meters, that's awesome because you can send out the, the packets of uh, data. But if you've only got a receiver, you know, it's also a lot of fun. 10 metres is very high at the moment. Check the maximum usable frequency, the MUF um, website, and just see if it's possible. We're getting a lot of 10 metre stuff over here. And um, I've just got a simple CB aerial on the car. It's a modified one, but uh, conditions are pretty amazing. OK, so I'll end it there and I'll put a photo up briefly showing the Facebook group. So 73 uh, 20 UKH.